IFAD livelihood improvement family enterprises for the Niger Delta Life ND project recently conducted an orientation session for over 2,000 new incubates in Cross River State, part of a broader effort across six states to boost job creation, food security, and income generation. The orientation held across various districts aimed to prepare participants for success in agribusiness, entrepreneurship, emphasizing discipline, hard work, and adherence to project guidelines. State and national project coordinators underscored the importance of knowledge and proper understanding of project objectives for achieving rural economic transformation. Engineer Molino, who represented the National Project Coordinator, Engineer Sani Abiodun, congratulated the over 2,000 qualified incubates who were selected from a large pool and participated in the screening in December 2023. He reminded them to be disciplined, loyal, obedient, and adhere to the operational guidelines of the project and cherish what they have. Dr. Clement Uwem represented the NPC in the Central Senatorial District, while Mr. Kelly also well This is orientation training for the fifth part of uh, the life entity in the uh, Cross River State. And uh, today, we are inducting you into the life entity training. What is life entity? Life ND means livelihood, improvement, family enterprise in the Niger Delta. The main objective of this Life ND is to lift the youths of the Niger Delta out of poverty. So we are taking charge of women headers households, youth between the age of 18 to 35, and also physically challenged. The Commissioner for Agriculture, Crops and Irrigation Development, Honorable Johnson Ebopo, who was ably represented by the Permanent Secretary, Mr. Basi Epe, highlighted the commitment of Governor Chu in all agricultural and agribusiness enterprises, adding that his passion has been exemplified in the giant inroad towards creating jobs and repositioning the state as an export hub in the country. He commended the project for its initiatives in making the beneficiaries understand the thrust of the project before arming them with the necessary tools to succeed in life. Expressing his satisfaction in the distribution of inputs to deserving incubates last year, December 2023, Basi added that the administration of His Excellency Prince Basi Otu will give the project all the support, both outstanding and anticipated, to ensure proper deliverables as he charged the beneficiaries to show commitment and dedication in their chosen commodity and enterprise. This present government want to give back respect to them. Want people to realize that they should respect themselves. The past, everybody rushes to get what? 5,000, 10,000 from the politicians. Because you look down at capabilities, look down on yourself. So for choosing to participate in this program, I want you to know that you have started a journey, a journey of redemption, a journey that will make you proud of yourself. If you are from a short that the young men, the people who have been brought in, the men, the young men and women, are ready to go back and create jobs for themselves, like farming. And to produce producing food so that we can have food to eat and stay away from that we will lead them to find State Project Coordinator Mr. Innocent Obin highlighted the significance of the orientation in ensuring the success of the project, which targets 4,250 direct beneficiaries in Cross River State's first phase. 
Technical presentations covered various thematic areas, including project briefs, incubation models, environmental considerations, nutrition, financial inclusiveness, record keeping, and infrastructure development, equipping participants with essential knowledge for effective participation in agribusiness value chains. Projects like Life and the Project. It has come not to solve all the problems, but to assist, to support us, to quench hunger. And we can only do that if we put our hands on the plow. You are choosing. What are you now going to do with this choice? Some of them cannot keep record. Some of them are keeping record now. Some of them have been under transit. But because of this, they have gotten hard work to, to do. That's passionate. You can see some of our activities now. They are incubators. So I think there's a lot of impact. Some of the beneficiaries spoke in glowing terms about the positive impacts of the project. The program is very good. I like the program very well. I would like to 